in this tutorial I will show how to design outdoor lighting so uh, I have inputted this drawing from AutoCAD format and uh, suppose this is the building this will be our building this is uh, 2d view this uh, this will be our building and outside this here in this area we will uh, suppose we have some car parking area or walkway area so we will design the outdoor lighting calculation for this space outside of the building so uh, for this let's draw another rectangular floor element here outside of the building okay and also let's uh, define the uh, building first close okay so this is the building and uh, we go to story here this uh, building height let's say 7 meter now check uh, 3d view here this is the building and if we uh, check the entire site okay this is the area car parking area or in front of building uh, whatever you may call in uh, this zone I want to calculate the outdoor illumination for this simply uh, go to this light tab here I want to assign uh, the lighting fixture here wall mounted let's select the luminaire as I have already shown how to search the luminaire so if you uh, go uh, by brands and then by brands you can you can select from brand from here you can uh, you can import the required uh, lux level uh, fixer otherwise another option is there or uh, go to loom search from here also I have uh, brought this lighting fixer and I will use this uh, this floodlight fixer this is uh, if you see this uh, light details you can see okay so uh, let's draw draw line arrangement from this corner to this corner okay now uh, as you can see this height this height is less uh, we will define the height first here you can see um, uh, this mounting type so here like uh, this mounting height we can define some building height was uh, 7 meter so uh, let's say 6 meter elevation we want to put this light okay now you can see the uh, direction is towards this side so we need to rotate we need to rotate uh, which side this side that means clockwise so select this and uh, from here you can select uh, rotation this rotation so it should be clockwise 90 degree clockwise direction now you can see yes so this is now wall mounted okay another thing is that you can select the uh, you can select by number of luminaires suppose this is 10 you can customize also suppose uh, you are defining eight numbers so 
two, four, six, eight, so total eight numbers. Or you can define by uh, this uh, distance, this uh, uh, luminar distance, light to light distance. You can specify according to this also. And uh, here you can change, customize this data. So let's say a 10. So it is now 10. And uh, suppose uh, this is now 90 degree, and uh, this uh, this light will go um, uh, mainly straight along along the wall. We want to or give some angle so that it can be incl inclined so for this we can uh, see that uh, arrangement rotation here mounting type and here that is the rotation suppose 20 deg 20 degree no, we want towards off. That means put minus so it will move opposite direction. You can see this light is now upwards. So in this arrangement, so uh, this illumination level will be better. Now we have uh, uh, fixed the uh, lighting that uh, floodlight flood light, uh, positions, their angle and uh, photometric data. So this is the luminaire we have selected. This is uh, uh, connected load is 38.5 watt. This is the luminaire rating. So from this catalog, we have selected this luminaire. Nothing to do here. Okay, so we have checked this arrangement, position also, uh, rotation and mounting type. Now, to calculate, we have to go to calculation object tab here. Calculate active lights in only. Okay. Now, let's uh, calculate the illumination level here. Now, it is calculating. Okay. Here, uh, we want to check the illumination level uh, for uh, this plane. So, results on the surface click on this plane. Okay. As you can see, this is the uh, illumination level on this surface. And here we can see this is 59.6 lakh. Can click here this on this plane this average uh, lux level is 59.6 lux we can change the lux level uh, in so many ways we can change the lux level by changing the distance between the floodlight fixtures number one number two by changing the uh, angle this inclination angle uh, of floodlight with respect to wall and number three we can change this lighting design by changing the fixer selection let's say okay this is the 2d view To change the uh, to to get the options, let's go to light. Select the fixtures here. From here, you can change the number and also mounting type, height, rotation. Suppose I want to change this uh, angle instead of minus twenty, it is thirty. 
yes now this angle changed and if we uh, again calculate then this value will be changed so previously it was this value 59.6 lakhs if we calculate again then you will notice this lux level will be changed you can see this is now 53.5 lux this is minimum lux level and this is maximum lux level and this is mean by average ratio is 0 0.1 suppose we have the target uh, here the 50 lux so in that case it, the average lux level is 53.5 lux in this way you can change suppose uh, let's change again instead of uh, 10 if we use 8 numbers yes now calculate okay now it you can see this is uh, reduced uh, to 42.9 lakhs but our requirement is 50 lakhs so in that case uh, either we uh, need to replace this uh, lighting fixer to the higher rated higher rated uh, flood lights or we can adjust the uh, fixer to fixer distance again or the angle let's select and here suppose this is 25 so we are changing the angle let's run the calculation again now it is further reduced to 46.2 lux So it is changed now this value can change so in this way we can optimize the uh, average lux level of the uh, the outdoor area what we want to design so along the periphery of the building or any other uh, open space also the main thing is that we need to select the area outdoor area which area we want to design the uh, illumination level after that we need to place different types of floodlights it may be wall mounted it may be wall mounted or maybe pole mounted high mast structure but the basic thing is that uh, we need to select the outdoor areas and on which uh, surface plane we are uh, uh, we want to get the illumination level so thus we can design the outdoor level calculation.